I've downloaded one of the craziest mods for Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3, and I've done it all so that Goku and Vegeta can finally fight at their full manga power. As you can see here, when we look at Goku, we have every single form available to him in the entire manga. You probably, if you played Budokai Tenkaichi 3, you definitely don't remember all this. But even if you have, you definitely don't remember all of this, even if you just seen the anime. Yeah, we're talking manga level powers here. Some light spoilers even. As for Vegeta, it's more of the same, only he only has one panel. He's got God, Blue, Evolution, and Ultra Ego. Anyway, I just wanted to see him fight, so we're going to start with a match in base form, then kick it up to gods, and then see these two in their max form. Here we go, after their last match was cut off, what is this new UI? Alright, their last match was cut off of roughly, this is Z-level difficulty CPUs. Anything can happen now. Nice block from Goku. And a grab attempt, but Vegeta not gonna allow it. The Key Blast Kid and Vegeta's in control this time. A clash! CPU's fighting for the life. Vegeta of the clear win. Was that a whole bar worth of damage? What was that? That had to be a visual bug. Ain't no shot. Meteor combination from downtown! Goku takes him right back to where it was all started. Looking like Piccolo right now. Damn! Bit of a chip damage here. Goku is definitely not in the lead. Goku has two blue bars. Another meteor combination. Vegeta not going to let it go down without a clash. By God, Vegeta just in control of the match. Oh, Goku with the weave back. He's not getting hit by that obvious stuff. I don't think Vegeta cares, though. He was just kind of laying him out for real. Cross chop. Down on his luck. Oh, can't hit what you can't see. Will anybody transform into a Super Saiyan this fight? We've seen the original. Vegeta just seems dominant, in control. He's not letting Goku do whatever he wants. Goku weaves a few of the attacks. Super explosive wave. How does he... He doesn't answer with anything. Vegeta has a huge lead. Goku's clothes are all torn up. Wild sense. Not going to be enough. Another clash. Vegeta just winning by about a million. I'm pretty sure Vegeta's the only one on the new difficulty. I'm going to be honest. It looks like Vegeta's sticks just move a little faster than Goku's. Super Saiyan! He's decided to kick it up a not. Damn! Goku's decided to kick it up to Super Saiyan, but is it even close? He dodges back. He didn't respond at all. Vegeta with the wide open. Oh, no. It's pretty much over for Goku here. Goku does it. Manage to dodge an attack. Steps up. Dodges back. Super energy wave volley. Takes a bit of damage. He's going to kick it up to Super Saiyan 2. Goku, for the first time in his life, is trying. He's finally trying. He might stay in a bit of a chance against Vegeta, but he's only got a little bit of time left. Vegeta, not one to be outdone, also kicks it up a level. Here he comes. He could end Goku right here with Big Bang Attack. Goku has failed in the first fight. He's lost to Vegeta, even with Super Saiyan 2. But now we're back, and for this match, we're kicking it up to the God level. We're on Planet Beerus now for the God level fight between Goku and Vegeta. All in. And it's time to go all in. Oh, our contestants know what's on the table. Oh, a strong open. Vegeta opting to go for a Gallic Gun. Takes half of Goku's first life bar in one foul swoop. Goku is pissed about it, though, very clearly. Vegeta, another strong opener. Goku tries to go for the drop kick. Vegeta not playing around. Behind the back. Goku, nine hits. Not able to make it ten. He loves that drop kick move. He, he lands it this time. Strong combo starter. Divine Kamehameha. Looks a lot like a normal Kamehameha if you blink. It's hard to read the new UI. I'm not going to lie. This mod's UI, uh, I ain't a fan. It's hard to see how many health bars they have when they're, they're layered green. Here we go. It's a transmission. He's behind. Prominence flash. Goku says no. He's not going to allow that to happen. Vegeta stops it. Anime. What an encounter. Goku loses. Not going to let Vegeta get Saiyan Soul off. Oh, strong opener. Goku is down two health bars, though. Is this right side favoritism? Anime! Goku wins it! I'm not sensing any favoritism anymore. He's gonna kick it up to blue! He gets by Vegeta and goes blue! But he got too concerned with the color of his hair and missed the combo. <gasps> Vegeta with Kamen. Another anime. Another anime moment. Goku's on his last health bar, though. He'd have to hit land a lot of attacks if he's gonna hope to win. Vegeta's triggered to Saiyan Soul. Goku with his back turned to Vegeta. It's pretty much over. It's pretty much over. Vegeta with a prominence flash could put him away, and he does! By God, if the CPUs are no favoritism, this is getting bad. All right, UI Goku Omen versus Vegeta Blue Evolution. Here we go. The matchup in their final forms on this game before we get to manga level power. Vegeta Blue Evolution versus Omen UI. A godly display, Vegeta can't block the speed. A huge amount of damage. Actually respectable, only 6K. I thought he was losing two health bars for that. Goku charging up Vegeta. Gets countered. He's gonna lose the flash. 
Oh my god, he got rocked! Goku running up. Vegeta with a display of Ki Blast. Damn! UI Goku just flipped him! Goku Omen, but he still got the speed. Damn! 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 Another godly display. It's over. UI Goku Omen clearly right side favoritism playing a huge side here. Also, just a different beast, not the same one. Charges up in full control. Backflip in a final flash, but what a dodge! That'll get a health bar for sure. Could Vegeta fight back against the right side favoritism? Not when he catches Supreme Kamehameha's. Big charge up here. UI Goku opting to just stand still. He actually did dodge a considerable amount of Ki Blast. Damn. Damn. Why you got to do it to him like that? The, here comes the clash. Yeah, the right side favoritism actually does kick in hella heavy on the sticks. I don't know if it's supposed to be that far apart, but this wasn't even... Wait. Nope. This wasn't even a match. Damn. Watch out, Vegeta. He's right behind you. Wild tense. Damn. Ha <laughs> ha. Unreal. Well, we're going to switch over to the manga level powers now. All right. We're back with manga level powers. This time, let's kick it up to UI. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. UI versus Ultra Ego. Here we go. The final battle with the modded Goku and Vegeta so they can fight at their full manga accurate power levels. Perfected UI Goku versus Ultra Ego Vegeta. Don't mind that noise. I don't know what that noise was. They're off. Getting space from one another on the Cell Games Arena. Goku opting to charge. Vegeta, not going to let that slide. Damn. Oh, he's too quick. Has the manga advanced too far past Ultra Ego Vegeta? No, he's going to respond with a headbutt of his own. Gigantic key blast from Goku. Vegeta dodges, but the guard is too good. UI Goku has a clear health bar lead on the first one. Vegeta teleports behind him at full power. Vegeta blinks. What is he even doing? My God, what's Vegeta going for? Whoa, Ultra Ego Vegeta. With the, a, a, a Kai version of Heat Dome attack? What's even happening? He's out of this world. Kamehameha, but with a full cutscene activated. Divine power. Goku's achieved his full level. He has access to his ultimate. A burst combo even. Will he go for any of them? Ultra Ego. Both fighting at their max strength now. Damn. Ultra Ego Vegito's a different beast. What is that? Super Bomb to Divine? If Goku wins this, it's over. He might do it again. He's coming. Goku dodges. Knocks him down to the ground. Another clash. It's a heated combination. Goku almost had the Spirit Bomb. The Divine Spirit Bomb. I don't even know what he was going for. He's charging back at Vegeta. Vegeta goes with another clash. It's another clash of the Titans. A battle that I can barely keep my hands on. Full power of Vegeta again. He teleports. Oh my god, Goku's... What's happening? Vegeta! A Hakai Energy Ball lands on Goku. It takes an easy two bars. Destroys the Earth as well. Could Vegeta have turned to his evil ways? It's gone. UI Goku's lost him. He found him just in the... Barely. Just barely in time. I will say Goku's going to need a miracle comeback at this stage. Vegeta's just beating him down far too much. Divine power. Could Goku try to land his ultimate one more time? Not just Vegeta's elbow. My God, could he be going for the burst combo? Vegeta just can't seem to block. Kamehameha, the key blast, make it combo. Vegeta's at three bars. Goku's staging a bit of a comeback here. Goku can't be hit. Could this be a Zenkai boost? Vegeta trying to fall, but there's nowhere to go. Goku backsteps with nowhere to go. Full power, guy. Goku gets behind him, but Vegeta blocks the Ki Blast from behind with no vision? What an anime clash! If Goku gets hit by this, it's over! He barely manages to dodge! It's Ultra Ego, that means he has access to full Ki! Divine Power, Goku has access to full Ki! It's gonna come down to who can land their ultimate. Vegeta's going for the burst combo! Goku finds a place to block, misses attack, dodges the Ki- If Goku can't break away from this, it's over! Another clash! Barely in the nick of time! Goku loses, though. Vegeta tries to follow up. Goku's playing safe. He gets something off, but it doesn't go. Wild sense. It's over. Vegeta wins with two bars. But I will say, Goku didn't tap into his final form. So just for the f f for funsies, we're going to see a what if. What if Goku tapped into the full power of Ultra Instinct? He never called upon it in the match. But could we be looking at something different here? The perfected Ultra Instinct. Susano edition. Could Vegeta have stood up to this? Damn, he's still throwing hands. Vegeta still not afraid. Even with the newfound power, it's not enough. In fact, the cameraman just can't keep up. That's the only difference of the fight. Maybe it's for the best Goku to tap into this form. He seems sluggish. Bro, he's fighting at 2 FPS. He missed. Damn. The Susano is just too slow. It was never meant to be used like this. I don't know if Goku can deflect that. 
but he does dodge it. Even in his giant Susano form, he's pretty quick on his feet. What's he going for? No shot. I don't even know what this thing's ultimate is. Oh, shit. It doesn't matter. Vegeta grabbed his big ass leg. He's doing something. What is this? Vegeta managed to stop it. He lands the grab. Oh, my God. He's a giant of a man. Backstep into Kamehameha with one hand? That was sick. That was a sick animation, to be honest. And he dodges the technique as well. Clearly, there are some benefits to Goku's Susanoo form, even if he is slow as all hell. Could he be going for his ultimate? Again, I don't know what it is. And it doesn't look like we're ever going to find out. <laughs> Damn, the Susanoo was too strong. Well, that's going to be the match. Goku versus Vegeta, full manga powers. Let me know if you want to see this again, but maybe a best of three format and maybe in the tournament. I think that could be fun.